in class 6 today we are going to start a new chapter of your book that is chapter 5 percentage and its application already you are familiar with this concept of percentage as you have done percentage in class 5 also so just recapitulate two or three things then we will go through the worksheets students already you know what is percentage percentage means a fraction in which the denominator is 100 19 by 100 examples 2 by 100 and this will be written as 2 percent 5 percent these things already you have done in class 5 just recapitulate it how you can convert a percentage into fraction simply you have to remove this sign and uh, write it 100 okay similarly all of you know how to convert percentage into uh, decimal first you will remove this sign make it fraction and then divide it you will get percentage as um, decimals next mixed number as percentage ratio as percentage okay and um, decimals as percentage all of you know these things two things we have to keep in mind while we are removing percentage we have to divide it by 100 and we have when we have to find out the percentage then we will multiply the given number or fraction by 100 so this these are the key rules and now let's go through the worksheet you will recapitulate page number 90 and 91 very easy concepts all of you have done these things in class 5 okay right now we will go through the questions of worksheet 1 and 2 suppose i have taken this example of worksheet 1 question number 1a you have to find percentage of rupees 63 of rupees 90 very simple all of you know that 63 will be the numerator okay and total will be the denominator that is 90 and you have to find the percentage so you multiply it by percentage simply after solving you will get 70 percent as answer now let's see question of it so first question all of you can do the small number will be the numerator greater number denominator and then you have to multiply that by 100 simply the questions are very simple based on the same basis only you have to find percentage in this chapter uh, in this worksheet sorry so uh, you will multiply each question by 100 suppose we are taking one more example uh, question number three a man earns rupees 12,000 and spends 10,500 rupees if he saves rest of money find the percentage of his savings so you have to find the percentage of saving so you must find the savings first then saving will be the numerator total earning that means 12,000 will be the denominator and you have to multiply that fraction with 100 let's see how so total earnings 12,000 expenditure rupees 10,500 saving will be uh, 1,500 rupees after subtracting this you will get the savings now percentage of saving 1500 by 12000 into 100 so simply you will get answer 12.5 percent in the same way you have to solve all the questions of worksheet 1 that is very easy students i think all of you can do that but uh, if you have any problem then we will sort out those problems in our zoom classes now in worksheet 2 is same as worksheet 1 only two things you have to keep in mind when you see the words like less subtract decrease then you will subtract uh, you have to do one uh, operation of subtraction and when you uh, listen, uh, see the words like more increase add then you have to do an operation of addition in the question so let's go through the question the amount 6% more than 120 so what you have to do you have to find 6% of 120 and then you will add that result with 120 as 
it is done in the examples find the amount 5% more than 600 first we have to find 5% of 600 and then we have to add 30 yani obtained result with the uh, given number okay 600 plus 30 so in this way you have you can do worksheet 2 also very few questions are there five questions are there you can do it whenever you listen less you subtract whenever you see more you add so let's do one question of it suppose i am taking fourth question the monthly consumption of milk in a family is 120 liters if due to festival the consumption of milk increased by 20 percent so increased okay so what you have to do you have to very good you have to add find the percent percent consumption of milk so what you will do first you will write monthly consumption of milk 120 liter increased consumption of milk that will be 120 into 20 by 100 that means we are finding 20 percent of 120 that is 24 liter then we will find present consumption of milk by adding 24 to 120 the method are same so finally you will get 144 as answer in the same way uh, you will be able to solve all the questions of your both the worksheets so worksheet 1 and 2 will be your uh, assignment for today uh, that's all for today have a nice day okay